Hello everyone. Hope you are doing well. I am Dr. Mazhar Ali and we will learn today the Python programming. So we will generate uh, the first program in the Python and uh, run that first generated program on the command line. So to generate the program uh, on the Python, we have to open the integrated development learning environment of the Python. For this purpose, we have to go to the uh, menu. So we will go to the start menu and uh, open the uh, ID integrated development uh, learning environment of the Python. And um, it's uh, opened now. So we will just, uh, it's a uh, very easy to print your first program in Python development, uh, learning environment. Uh, there are two ways to uh, generate the program. Number one, you may uh, write your program here and you may get result. And another way, uh, you may write your program in the editor and may get uh, results of your coding. But there are advantages and disadvantages of both environment. So just I write here, uh, I, I will tell you the advantages and disadvantages of both environment. But first I write here my program, uh, print space, and then uh, definitely if when we show the message, we have to quote that message, quotation mark, hello word. And we will close the quotation and again the bracket. And so now we will enter. So after enter, you will see here, this is the result, hello word. And we may generate several lines. So what is the advantage of uh, this environment? We get the results rapidly. Means at that when we enter uh, our uh, query, we get the result. But the, what is the disadvantage of uh, this environment? We cannot store our code here, and even we cannot modify this code. For example, this is my code. Uh, I cannot uh, modify, uh, even modify, but uh, it cannot uh, be stored for a long time. Therefore, uh, we need a file or the editor. Because programmers uh, need a, a separate editor uh, th where they can code uh, in different times when their mood is fine. So we will open the file and the, okay, this is the uh, editor, Python editor, or we may call it the integrated development learning uh, environment. So again, we will uh, type the same, just the print uh, and the quotation mark. Hello world and quotation over, bracket over and we will store the control is depend on you either you are pressing the control is or going to the file menu is and uh, we will write here uh, program name. So again uh, you may give any name uh, to the Python uh, program what you like for example we give the word. A word, there must be the extension of the file. That is the pi. That is the pi. And where we have to store? We have to store in the Python's script folder. Because we have generated a, a script. So we will open the script folder and we will save there uh, word.py. Okay, so we are going to save the file. Save. The file is saved. Now we have to go to the command line to uh, see a result. So we'll uh, right click the menu and open the command prompt that is available. So now open, we will write here just what was the file name? word.py. Very good. So just um, we will now enter. Enter. Oh, good. The result is uh, here. Look here. Hello word. We have written the hello word. So if you want to write more and more your sentences, you may write here. Uh, for example, you are writing here, uh, print the quotation mark. Hello world, I am, uh, this is my first program in the Python. And the quotation over and bracket over and control is to save the file. So file is a save, again we have to confirm, and here we press the save, okay, now we we'll go to command prompt and write here, uh, what was the file name, word.py, and we enter it, 
okay if you see uh, look here the fir first program was hello world that is also uh, here and now we added this line this is my first program in the python so dear uh, my dear it's a very easy to run the uh, py file in command line but one thing more which you may face you see here i run all these commands on my prompt uh, uh, <coughs> terminal so how it runs if you didn't uh, make the path or you then your program will not run on the uh, this terminal why the, my programs are running the, on this terminal because i made the path and to make the path is not a tough or problematic it's a very much easy what will you do you have to just uh, copy your location where you store the file because you you will run the file from your storage so what will you do you will just open the uh, environment definitely uh, files are installed on the c drive by default so we will go to the c drive and we will find where the python oh this is anaconda anaconda is some uh, this is for the jupyter notebook inshallah we will uh, in another uh, lecture learn how to uh, work on anaconda but we have uh, to uh, find out the python oh we find out this is the python 27 so two, 27 means 2.7 we will double click it to open and then again we will go to the scripts where our files are stored uh, double click the script and you will see uh, different files are here cfg other things first generator hello my program and 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 and, and. The different programs are here even this is our own program word which we stored here but we have to uh, take the path address so we uh, click on the address bar and uh, now we see the path address is here we will control c it or even you right click here and copy because we are going to uh, make a path for our uh, programming and uh, to run the program so now we will uh, go to the system so right click on the start menu and uh, we will press the system button and system button keep in mind in the system button you have to open the advanced advanced system settings so we press uh, advanced system settings and now we see here in the end there is an environment variable so we press here environment variable nothing else but environment variable only so we look here different uh, uh, Formats are two formats are here. One is uh, this one, and uh, second is uh, this. So this is for me, and this is for my system variable. So definitely, I have already uh, developed a path. We will. Oh, this is my path. That's why you see same path is here. If I show you, I edit it. Same path is here. But if that is not available on the your system, what will you do? You will just go to the new. Here in the variable name, you will uh, write just path, and in the variable value, you will just paste the address what you copied from your uh, address bar. And here you will press the OK. Is my file is already stored here, so I am not pressing the OK. But you will have to press OK, and then after OK, you will have to uh, refresh your uh, terminal. Why will you refresh the terminal? Because uh, it get all the data and here you will again write your program. For example, now I write here hello.py, another program. You see here, hello world, this is my first program. And even again, um, my program.py, if it is available here, this will also open. So you see here, this is also open. So it's not uh, tough to generate a file and run on the command line. So today we learned what to generate the file in the Python uh, development uh, environment. And we run the file on the command file, uh, command line. And we also learned how to uh, create a path. So we <coughs> created the path and uh, run again the different programs. So take care, hope you learned a lot. If you like it, 
uh, then like uh, the program and subscribe the channel. Thank you very much.